Welcome back to the Super Memory for Schools program. Today, in the English program of 8th grade, Mr. Hui will accompany you in Lesson 2 of Unit 4, Our Past. Now let's look into some vocabulary that will appear in today's lesson. We have broken heart, broken heart, broken heart. Fairy, fairy, fairy. Rags, rags, rags. For example, the Cinderella wears rags. Fall in love with, fall in love with. Fall in love with means he falls in love with her. Servant, servant, servant. Master. Master, master. Cruel, cruel, cruel. Straw, straw, straw. Stripe, stripe, stripe. Escape, escape, escape. Graze, graze. We usually use this word for cattle like cow or buffalo. For example, we have the buffalo is grazing on the field. And in today's grammar lesson, we will research about a topic grammar called used to. Now, let's begin with used to. Please consider it as a normal verb used in simple past tense. It is nothing special. So, in the affirmative form, used to will have the formula subject plus used to plus verb bare infinitive. In the negative form, we will have subject plus didn't use to plus verb bare infinitive. Because it is only a verb of simple past tense, we just simply borrow the auxiliary verb didn't when we want to use the negative sentence. And in the question form, it will have the formula did plus subject plus used to plus verb bare infinitive. But you should take note that we already borrowed the auxiliary verb did, so use will return into bare form and we no longer have the letter D. Now, let's check the following example. He looked after his younger brother, but he doesn't now. He looked after his younger brother, but he doesn't now. So we will use used to to connect this sentence together, and we will have the result. He used to look after his younger brother. He used to look after his younger brother. And you should notice the verb look after now because you already had used to, so we will turn look back to the original form. According to the formula, used to plus verb bear infinity. Next example we have. I was afraid of ghosts when I was young. I was afraid of ghosts when I was young. And we will connect this sentence with used to. The answer is, I used to be afraid of ghosts when I was young. I used to be afraid of ghosts when I was young. You also should notice that used to plus verb bear infinity, so we will return was to be, used to be. He often does exercises now, but he didn't in the past. He often does exercises now, but he didn't in the past. So we will have the sentence, He didn't use to do exercises. He didn't use to do exercises. Now let's summarize what we have learned in this lesson, guys. About the vocabulary, we have broken heart, broken heart, broken heart. Fairy, fairy. Rags, rags. Fall in love with, fall in love with. Cruel, cruel. Servant, servant. Master, master. Straw, straw. Stripe. Stripe. Escape. Escape. Graze. 
grace. And in the grammar section, we learn about the verb used to. When we use used to in the affirmative sentence, you will have the formula subject plus used to plus verb bear infinity. When we express the negative sentence of used to, you use didn't used to plus verb bear infinity. Please remember, because we borrowed the auxiliary verb did, so use no longer have letter D, returning to original form. Similarly, with the question form, we will put did at the beginning of the sentence. Next is subject and used to. The word used to will return to its original form and then followed by a bare infinitive. That's everything we need to learn and memorize in Unit 4, our past lesson 2 today. See you in the next lesson of the Super Memory for Schools. Goodbye, see you again.